Hi, I'm Rudy Winston with Canon USA with three exciting lens introductions that target professional and serious enthusiast photographers and videographers. We're launching three tilt-shift lenses with macro capability. The TSE 50mm f2.8L macro lens and the TSE 90mm f2.8L macro lens are direct replacements for current tilt-shift lenses and an outstanding new lens for products, portraits, landscapes, and creative effects. The TSE 135mm f4L macro lens with both tilting and shifting capability. Each of these lenses will focus manually to infinity, but also offer close focusing to half life size, 0.5 times magnification. You can fill the frame with a subject smaller than a business card. These three lenses join our current wide-angle tilt-shift lenses, the TSE 17mm f4L and the TSE 24mm f3.5L version 2, giving us a family of five outstanding L-series tilt-shift options. The choices in focal length are similar to conventional lenses, providing a wide-angle perspective, a standard perspective, or a telephoto perspective. Tilt shift isn't just for architecture. These are tremendous options in the studio or on location. For products ranging from watches to cars, close-ups of small objects, portraits, and miniature effects. And they're as effective for creative video shooting as they are for still images. Let's quickly review how tilt shift lenses are used and why. The shift function is primarily to control perspective distortion. We've all seen shots of something like a building where the camera was aimed upward and vertical lines begin to take on a pyramid effect. The shift function lets you correct this. Aim the camera so it's level with the ground, then move the front section of the lens upward to get the entire subject in the frame. You can shift up to 12 millimeters up down, left, or right. Shift can also move a subject in the frame without moving the camera or tripod. The tilt function is entirely different. By tilting the front section of the lens, you can change the plane of what's in sharp focus and extend the range of sharpness in many situations, even at wide shooting apertures. For example, focus on the nearest part of a subject and then tilt the lens to get even distant elements sharp. At close focus distances, remember these lens focus to half life size, you can get powerful control over the range of sharpness in an image. The 50mm and 90mm TSE lenses both have a maximum aperture of f2.8 for a nice shallow depth of field when you need it. The shift and especially the tilt knobs are larger for easier operation. A tilt locking switch also firmly locks the lens in the zero tilt position to prevent unintended tilting when you start shooting. Shift and tilt can rotate together up to 180 degrees with solid click stops every 30 degrees. And if you need to independently change the axis of tilt, you can rotate just the tilting section of the lens. For example, this could allow you to shift upward and tilt upward in the same image. All three are L-series lenses with outstanding optical performance and exceptional mechanical strength, durability, and operational smoothness. The bottom line is a clear statement of Canon's commitment to our professional customers. With these three tilt-shift lenses, users now have outstanding options for image control in normal and telephoto focal lengths. The 135mm lens in particular is sure to open doors to creative studio, portrait, and even nature shooters. Look for more information on Canon USA's website. For Canon USA, I'm Rudy Winston. Thanks for watching.